Hey everyone, this is Ross, and this is a request vid for Angry Pooch. And you wanted to know how to tell the difference between male and female shrimps. Unfortunately, I only know how to tell the difference between um, Amano shrimps and red cherry shrimps. So, first of all, I'll tell you how to sex Amano shrimps. Um, so, the males will generally be smaller than females, but they'll have a lot longer whiskers and they'll have distinct spots down the side of the body. Uh, the males will be very skinny, especially in the tail. Um, this is a male on that java fern. Um, and he's got a very skinny tail. Uh, he has two males. As you can see, very skinny tail, very long whiskers. And he has a female. She is much larger than the males there. If I get them in one picture, you can see there's the male and there's the female. So males are generally a lot smaller. Females are a lot bigger. Um, males have got long antennae, females have got short antennae. Uh, the males have got distinct spots down the side of the body. And the females usually have a, like a, a broken up dotted line. So, um, yeah, they're the main distinguishing features of a mano shrimp. And for red cherry shrimp, the female is usually bigger, just like a mano's. The male's usually smaller. Uh, the males usually have longer whiskers, just like the manos. Females usually have sh uh, shorter whiskers. And um, the females usually have a deeper coloration, like a darker red. More like a blood red, whereas, whereas the males' uh, colour is a little lighter. But the colour can't really be relied upon to sex them. Because the darker the substrate, the more red the turn. So really a male kept in a dark substrate tank um, could turn his colour really dark and if a female was kept in a light substrate tank then her colour would go really light so it's it's kind of hard to tell um, so really just go on a size test if the shrimp's a lot bigger when it's mature then um, it's probably going to be a female and if it's um, got very short whiskers compared to the rest then that's probably going to be a female as well um, I don't know if I mentioned um, about saddles uh, female and mano shrimps will have a saddle of eggs in the back which they carry and when they mature and when they're fertilized that those eggs will then drop down to underneath the tail this a mano shrimp's got a saddle right here underneath the tail right there so that shows it's a female and that also happens in red cherry shrimp too. There's a saddle of eggs comes from the back down underneath the tail. And that's how you tell if they're a female as well. But generally the size rule works. So if they're fully mature, then um, you can usually tell because of the size. Alright, so if you learned anything, and if you like this vid, then please leave a nice comment. Uh, please like the vid and please subscribe. Thank you. Bye.